The sun is not my place to tell you how to run a household, but you've got some problems here in the cupboard. What do you mean? You have cereals, your flour, and your sugar. All these boxes should be wrapped in plastic bags. Why? Keeps out the ants. Dad, we don't have ants. Not yet. All it takes is one, the scout ant. <laughs> Yeah. Scout ant. He's the one that other ants send out to buy food, and if he sees that, before you know it, you have a house full of ants. Well, I just want to tell you, that my wife and I have been here for 20 years, no ants. Well, that's the way ants operate. They lull you into complacency. Send <laughs> <laughs> up the scout ants now. Rudy, who's this? It's a boyfriend, Kenny, and I use this boy. Nice to meet you, Kenny. Thank you. I have a grandpa, too. What's his name? Grandpa? <laughs> You're gonna go out and play. I want you to put hats on because it's cold out there. I didn't bring a hat. I'll get you one. Come on. That looks like a happy team. Yeah. They're happy for about three minutes and then they'll be arguing again. No, I don't believe it. Not those two. I hope you're right, but you're not. <laughs> Here, where's this hat? It's Theo. Okay, thanks. Let's go. Wait, I have to open the door for you. No, you don't. Yes, I do. I'm a man. You're a woman. <laughs> so, a man's supposed to open a door for a woman. Who says it? My big brother. He's my thief. He knows everything. Well, Sancho says a woman can do anything. No. <laughs> a woman can do a man thing. <laughs> oh, not me. <laughs> and you'll never get married. I will if I want to. Okay, but you'll have to stay with cook. Clothes. Now, uh, a woman can have any job she wants. No, she can't. Give me back my hat, bud. <laughs> my name's Kenny, bud. My name's Kenny, bud. My name's oh, Kenny. Stop, stop, stop. Now, what, what, what's the matter? He's not my friend anymore. <sighs> yes, I am. No, you're not. Yes, I am. No, 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 no. stop, stop, Ed. <laughs> now, what is the matter? He tried to open the door for me. Oh, okay, okay. I'm supposed to. I'm a man. Wait, wait just one second. Now, look, Elvin. Who? <laughs> no, no, no. I thought you are Kenny. All right, Kenny. If the two of you want to act like a man and a woman, then if you're going to discuss things, you have differences, you do it politely. You understand? Yeah. yeah. All right, fine. Now, I am going to to open the door for both of you. Not because I'm a man, but because I'm a tired adult and I'm throwing you out. <laughs> I must say, son, you handled that well. Well, thank you, Dad. I had a good teacher. Hi. <laughs> uh, hey. Dad, you have to sign this. Hmm? What is it? A note from our principal. Why do you have a note from the principal? Well, I found out why I've been getting all the phone calls. The girls at school picked me as thoroughbred of the week. All right. Thoroughbred? Yeah, you know, a winner. You see, every week the girls pick a guy in the junior class, and they put his name and phone number on the wall of a girl's washroom. So why do I have a note from the principal? Well, when I found out about it, I went until after school. And then I went to the girls' washroom, and I started scribbling over my name and number. That's when the principal, Ms. Walker, came in and called me. She said, you have to sign that as proof that I told you about it. <laughs> Well, you told me about it, and I'm signing. Thanks a lot, Dad. You're welcome. You know, son, it seems like raising children is a lot more difficult now than when I was raising you. Well, I wish you'd have thought about that when you put the curse on me and said, I hope you have some children who act exactly the same way that you act. <laughs> well, things are working out better than I expected. <laughs>